Hey, what's up everybody? Prestige here. Welcome to episode number seven of our Bloodborne Let's Play. Today we're headed to Old Yarnum and we're going to try to defeat the hunter that has the Gatling gun on top of, I think it's a church or something. So hopefully we'll be able to get up there and defeat this guy. What I like to do is just knock him off the building. That's the easiest way to get the win. But we too can get knocked off the building. So we're going to try not to have that happen. Um, but I hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's do this thing. I haven't actually been in You're here. Hunter. Didn't you see the warning? Turn back and there he is, right over there. He's on top of a clock tower. I'm not turning around. Screw you, boy. I won't turn back. In, fa in fact, I will come and... Uh, I will kill you! Oh shoot. I'm still pretty high ranked for what this is right now, so that's good. Take care of some of these guys. And pick up some items along the way. Cold blood dew, that always helps. That can give us some more blood echoes. But what we're gonna do is just, our goal is to take that guy out. He's up on top of the tower there. We're gonna have to try to be very, very careful. I'm gonna run. Woo. I think I just took a shortcut, guys. I, I don't... Oh, yeah, I remember. Oh, man. I'm, I'm creeped out right now. I forget these places, dudes. I've done this part, okay? I remember doing this part, but I don't think I'm necessarily supposed to be in here yet. I don't know if I can light this or not. That'd be pretty, pretty sweet. Anyway, I can just hear enemies all around. We're just gonna keep picking up items. I know that these dudes can poison us in here. Okay, I'm supposed to be going through this way. I remember now. Oh, there he is. Hello. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this guy's evil. I'm a skilled hunter. I'm gonna come over there and kill you. You keep shooting me like that. This is where people normally get knocked off the bridge. Oh, I forgot a bunch of crows over here. Bloodstone shard. Oh, that's what I'm looking for too. I'm looking for some more uh, twin, twin stone shards so I can upgrade my axe again. If I'm not mistaken, something busts through that wall. Yeah, there it was. That always creeped me out, dude. Oh, blood tinge gemstone? I might be able to upgrade my weapon. Alright, this part. I'm just gonna run for it, guys. Oh, we're almost there. It was heavy. Monsters can climb ladders too, dudes. It's not funny. All right, here we go. We're gonna try to knock him off of the building. This is still pretty scary though. This is still pretty scary. He knows I'm here. Ooh! Heal! Heal! Let's try to get a... Let's try to... I'm a hunter too, boy. Oh God! No! Heal. 
Okay. There we go. You're gone. Got him. Got him! Whew. We took his butt out. He was shooting me with his big Gatling gun. Like, come on, really? I hope that we can actually pick his stuff up now because I know we get the, the one mark from him and we're able to buy his weapon. Oh, yeah, I think I see it right there. Sweet. That totally worked in our favor. Oh, hello. Awesome. Last time I, I hit that guy, he fell off the wrong side, and uh, it was not good. It was not good at all. I actually don't remember a lot of what's over here, so we're going to be a, a little more cautious here. I think that means I'm poisoned. I'm not sure. Or I think it means I will die instantaneously if I let it go all the way. Yeah, that's what that means. Got to be careful for that. We're going to go through here and just pick up a bunch of stuff. See if I can make my way along this without falling down. But that's a pretty pretty fun guy to fight there. If you can get him knocked off of the top there. Like we did. <gasps> oh, oh. I thought I was about to freaking fall to my death see if we can run and jump over there no gosh darn it I missed the jump I feel like a boss fight's gonna take place in here but I'm just not sure alright how do we get down without hurting ourselves that's a great question isn't it <laughs> I think the only way to go down is just to jump, but um, once again, yeah, I'm not really looking forward to hurting myself. Maybe we can fall on the side here, I don't know, we'll see. Nope. Well, I didn't get that hurt, it's alright. Looks like we got a lot of stuff going on in here, so let's just go ahead and take these guys out real quick. Oh crap. Oh crap, we can't let them hit us. I forgot about that. Oh no! No! Slow poisoning, okay. I'm poisoned. I guess that's what it means. If I get hit too much, I just get poisoned. Which I have antidotes, so I could, like, save myself. But it's really not damaging me that much, so we'll just hold off on using the antidotes. These big guys are creepy. Adept blood gemstone. Dang, you're like a ninja. I think it was attacking me so fast. Did you guys see that? Alright, let's go ahead and put on our antidote. Wherever this freaking thing is. Hello? Oh, it was right at the beginning. <laughs> Whoops. There we go. Yeah! Madman's knowledge. That looks so cool. I'll have to go back up top and try to like jump down to get to the right area. Oh yeah, I remember where we're going now. I remember where. We're going to open up this right here. I believe there's a gate that bars it off, but we're going to go ahead, recollect everything real quick. Try to go up top and just get all that stuff that we missed. And um, I'll go ahead and fast forward it really quick so you guys can just see the journey of collecting stuff. And then um, 
we'll go from there. So I will be right back to commentating. Enjoy the uh, speed, the speed boost of the video. All right, so we went ahead and collected everything from the rafters, and now what we're gonna do is head down into the city. Um, what I'm gonna try to do is find another area where we can light uh, our, our lantern and head back to the Hunter's Dream. And I think that would be a good place to stop for this video, so let's try to do that quickly. I'm not really sure what happens after this point. Like I said, I've I've played up until this boss here, or up until this uh, last hunter that we just fought, and after that, everything is just unknown to me. So I'm pretty scared. I'm gonna be pretty nervous for the time being, but I think it should be pretty fun. So we'll see what happens. I mean, the beginning is what it is. I mean, people people do the beginning. All the time but they rarely play through but I want to play through I think it'll be fun I think it'll be different and out of the ordinary I remember coming down here once before there's a bunch of werewolves I think they're a little bit of a higher level than me too if I remember oh no we're good we're good but there's a lot of werewolves down here really know what is next which like the mystery behind it really does make me quite scared oops I did not mean to do that <laughs> let's go ahead and heal ourselves. now we just hurt ourselves. now we've created some blood for ourselves there could be a boss and I don't even know about it like I could go through a door and end up getting attacked by a boss I don't know beast blood pellet oh that scared the crap out of me I did not expect to see that. Oh my gosh. Man, they set this game up like, oh, you want to walk this way? Heck no, you're not walking this way. Whoops. I don't know why I pressed Y to try to climb a ladder. Why? I don't. Oh my god. That actually frightened me. I'm not kidding. <laughs> and I don't know why I said Y. I meant to say triangle. Oh, this looks familiar. I think I saw this in a video. I used to watch a lot of videos about this this game right here. So if I say like something looks familiar, it's probably because I saw it in a video or something. Or maybe I've been right here. I don't know. I don't think so. Yeah, no, I've never been here. We're exploring together, guys. I knew it was too good to be true. Just an item sitting out in the open? Heck no, there's going to be something blocking it. I'll take a bow for you. Sometimes it does that. I don't know why. We'll just open doors along our trek to the top. Some fire paper. That, that'll come in handy. I had to use two against the last boss. That's fine. There's nothing over here. I feel like the deeper we get, the more scared I get. <laughs> Let's take this ladder up, see what's up at the top here. More enemies, I assume. It's a really, really tall ladder. This guy gives us twin stone shards. Oh no, he only gives a blood stone shard. That sucks. I remember I got twin stone shards from that guy before. But I guess not this time. 
I chased the the thing off the roof. Now I don't know where I'm at. <laughs> item. Oh, the torch. Dang it, I bought a torch. See, I got one right here. <laughs> I guess I could have saved that money and not bought a torch. Oh, crap. thought I was about to die. Guess we'll have to ascend the ladder again. There we go. This time, let's not let that thing distract us. <laughs> Maybe it was trying to take us away from this area because it looks like a pretty spooky. Oh, this is the beginning. This is legitimately the beginning where we started. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and run back in here, head to the Hunter's Dream, level up a little bit, and uh, close out this episode here. I was about to say, this looks really familiar. What are we doing here? <laughs> Bastard of Loran. Special material used in the Holy Chalice Ritual. Let's rank ourselves up a little. Very well, Leden. We can go up one more level. Go ahead and put it on endurance. See if any of these new uh, things will help our weapon out. Our new blood gems. Ah, nothing that we earned will help unfortunately that is that for this episode of the bloodborne playthrough if you guys enjoyed don't forget to click the like button down below to share your support and subscribe for more awesome bloodborne videos coming very soon until next time everybody i am out peace